Minister, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, friends. As you just have heard, progress demands innovation. This was also true for the Dutch who arrived here five centuries ago. Fleeing religious intolerance, persecution and economic crisis, they found a new home here in Poland. In return, they shared their knowledge of water and how to use it more innovatively. And this knowledge is as relevant now as it was then. Later this morning, there is to be a signing letters of cooperation and a contract, some on the theme of water management. And again, today, we hope to share our experiences in this field with you. After all, in the 1990s, which isn't that long ago, the Netherlands had to deal with major flooding itself. The problems we faced back then prompted a new way of thinking. We no longer see water in terms of a battle of man against nature. Rather, we strive for harmony and intelligent cohabitation. We believe that we should give water the room that it's due. To this end, over the past 20 years, the Dutch government has been intensively seeking corporations with companies and knowledge institutions. The aim is, not, is to tackle not only water issues, but also problems in, in related areas, energy, agriculture and logistics. And for us, the key word in all these fields is innovation. The exhibition you're about to see illustrates this. A striking Polish landscape with a city, countryside and water. But it's not just an ordinary city, no, it's a smart city. And also the countryside is state of the art. You will see technologi technological solutions for a sustainable approach to our surroundings. Your Majesties, ladies and gentlemen, just one last thing about water. This is where our new knowledge and expertise come into their own. We can help tame the natural forces of the mighty Vistula and at the same time unleash the river's economic power. Our businesses, our policy advisors, designers and engineers are here to assist you as they did five centuries ago. I do hope that this and the ensuing panel discussion will inspire you to build on centuries of Dutch-Polish cooperation and to work together even more closely. Your Majesties, Mr. President, Deputy Prime Minister, let me now invite you to join me in visiting the exhibition. Thank you.